Anime Rocker MCK here, back with another review of a different BL manga called Case Heaven. This one does have four volumes out currently. Right Stuff has yet to ship the fourth volume. It did come out December 8th, so I have not read that. But I wanted to review the first three for you guys so you can get a feel and decide if this is a BL you want to read. I'm going to start with volume one. And I'm going to give you the little summary on the back so you can read it if you would like. So this is a manga based off of a school life where they take playing cards as to ranks in the classroom. You go from king all the way to the bully, which would be number one or the joker card. You're going to start things off of volume one. We find out that Azuke, which is right here. He is the king, and they decide that they're going to have to play another case game halfway through the school year. He ends up getting the zero card, or the bully card, inside the game. So he's no longer in control. The person that ends up with control is a guy named Tasumi. Now him and Tasumi end up in a relationship where he pretty much controls everything about him. It is very much so where the bully cannot deny anything that the king wants. So he's forced into having any kind of sexual thing he wants or saying anything he does. That's why I'm not saying this is for everyone. Then we go on to volume two. Now, this is where it can get confusing. So volume one and volume two are actually based in the same exact time period. Except for in this volume, we're going to be following this kid right here. And this is a summary for this one. And his name is Kass? Case? Kass. I think that's how you say it. Even though he was a bully in the first book, he upgraded himself into the Jack. So he's now second in command in the school. He admits that he had loved him this entire time because of that. And they end up having a pretty nice relationship. This is all going on as well in the first book while he's having to deal with... Tasumi, who was pretty much forcing him to do whatever he wants. Now, the third book brings in two new characters where we find out that Tasumi has a half-older brother named Kerno, and he gets involved. He's pretty much supposed to be this perfect student, but instead he plays a rebellion inside the school. He doesn't want his family to find out about him. He has a secret love life as well with another guy who's on the cover right here. But he ends up doing all these badass things while in school. But in his home life, he has to act like a perfect person who doesn't do anything. So it is kind of unique. This one, again, is the slimmest out of the three. Although I can say overall, it is a little confusing to read because the story jumps in between the three at any given time. Where something that happened in volume one, you're back. Uh, backlash to it in volume three and then that tells you that time period of it through a different character's perspective so it's very unique um bl it's definitely not for everyone um i would recommend it if you like something that is a little more raunchy there is a lot of sex scenes in this but if you're just looking for a decent love story i wouldn't say pick this one up but let me know what you think about case heaven down in the comment section below make sure you like this video and subscribe